Ladies and gentlemen, hey guys. welcome back to What's another up? tierless Welcome back video. to another tierless video. Today we're going to be doing Smash, Smash character Ultra trailers. Smash. Yeah, yeah. That was so exactly. fucking bad. <laughs> <laughs> that was not like a unison at all. Bye guys, yeah. We need to we need to write a script. <laughs> no, we, no don't. we don't. So uh yeah. So these are just Smash trailers from Brawl. Smash 4 and Ultimate, mostly newcomer trailers. Uh, let's we'll just get right into it. Banjo Kazooie. Yeah. Um, you see, Banjo Kazooie was super hype. It was super hype. Um, but uh, oh, and Sam, what's up? You joined? Yes, I did. Jo I just joined. I just got. We home. just started. You just started. Good shit. Okay. Dummy. Um, so. Do you remember the trailers? Yes, or sir. All right. So I know. Mo I, I I know most of the. I know most of the Brawl and Ultimate trailers. I I, I only know a couple of the Smash 4 trailers. Yeah, no one remembers Smash 4, it's okay. Um, but, uh... Yeah. Nah, so Banjo-Kazooie... Here's what I think. Banjo-Kazooie was super hype, and, like, it was so hype to see him in Smash, I ultimately just ignored this, but... No pun intended. Haha. <laughs> it was... But it mostly just recycled King K. Rool's trailer, which I thought was a cool trailer, but... I don't think... I don't know, I can't put Banjo's trailer too high. I'm thinking B tier though, just because if you yeah, let's go B so right high. now. Uh, okay, yeah, Matt sure. Luigi agrees. Slash agrees. And Sam, what about you for Banjo? I agree. I'm just gonna say this. I know most people are happy for for Banjo and Kazooie to get in, but what, all, what I'm just gonna say, just a couple of his boot sets or like a couple of his combos are are, are kind of hard we're to not, do. We're so not, I we're not talking about that. We're just talking about the trailers. All right, then. All right, then the B tier. Okay. Yeah. Bayonetta from Bro. Smash 4, of course. Uh, so, um... The trailer is pretty cool. It kind of it kind of got right to the point. Uh, uh, I, I, I find it kind of weird when these Smash trailers do that. Um, I like the little narration and stuff. I, I like you know, the little banter Me between too. Palutena and Pit and uh, Bayonetta. Banter. I, I, I think I also have to put in B tier, though. Uh, what do you guys think? I say B tier as well. Sure. I'd say, yeah, I'd say D too. Okay. <laughs> Bowser Ju- I, I think Bowser Jr.'s trailer might be the first A tier. I don't know, that was just really cool. I think so as well. Alright. The, 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 and the way that yeah. they uh, revealed the Koopa Links, uh, they were already revealed because this- because Smash 3DS was out before this, and we had already, you know, played Bowser Jr. and everything, but I don't know, the way that the, um, the Koopa Links were officially revealed, I thought was really cool. Yeah. I know. Yeah, I know. The, I, I know. At the, I know. At the very beginning, I know most people like like when 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 Bowser Jr.'s clown car was shown like at the very beginning of the of the cutscene. I know most people are gonna say like it's Bowser Jr. before before it was revealed. For my suggestion, I will. In my opinion, I would probably say uh, a B tier again. Just 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 in my opinion. Yeah. Sorry, it's I don't know. Three on one though. I thought this trailer. Okay. Was yeah. Leave it out. I, Completely. Yeah, I just thought it, this trailer was really well done, and there was a lot of good um, animation and yes, the sir. choreography was really nice in this one. Yeah. All right. Next up Buddy. is uh, <laughs> is this one, uh, the uh, initial brawl trailer. Now this revealed brawl, and I, I like the little thing how it was. Um, you know, we go from uh, you know melee and then brawl, the graphical yeah. overhaul, right. which is pretty cool, and then. It revealed a ton of new characters like Pit, Meta Knight, Zero Suit Wario, and then Snake later on. Zero Suit Wario. Uh, Zero Suit Wario. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Right. Um, <laughs> uh, so, I don't know where to put this really. It's. I, I don't know. I really don't Yeah, know me neither. Because, I mean, I mean it's, like, it's just a reveal for a new game, really. Uh, I mean, just, j just, in ja just in that trailer, not like. Not like. All this, all, not all the Smash Bros. characters like minute into the cutscene, but I know at the very beginning of the game it does. So I would probably say B tier. I don't know. I feel like this trailer it was a really cool um, concept, and I feel like if they did it like today, it would be an S tier. But I feel like the trailer itself is a little dated because of yeah. um. No, but I, I really think the concept is quite good. Yeah. Um. But another thing is it didn't. Like, all it showed were Mario, Pikachu, Link, and Kirby, and then a bunch of newcomers. That's true. That's it true. It didn't show any other returning uh -huh. characters. That's another thing. 
I'm That's putting B tier. That's what I think. Now look, opinions on Byleth aside, I wasn't fucking mad when Byleth was announced. Obviously, I would have liked to see another character, but you know, what ultimately matters is you know how the character plays, if they're fun. So the fact that it's another Fire Emblem character didn't bother me too much. The trailer though was. I don't think the trailer was all that good, really. I think C tier. I, I would, I would probably, for me, I would probably say a D tier. Alright, explain. But when it showed the female Byleth, um, I know it, it, it's just like Robin. Like, you, you, like, you, can, you get uh, male Robin and female Robin, and then yeah. now you get and now you get a male Byleth and then a female Byleth. Yeah, I see what you mean. So I would probably say a D tier. I didn't really, I just, I'm not, I'm not, I'm just a tiny little bit of an anime fan, but I just didn't really like the cutscene, how it went. So, so my opinion, I would probably say D tier. Yeah. I don't. Slash and Pat Luigi, what do you guys think? I'll have to agree. agree with who? who? <laughs> with Aunt Sam. Slash? I don't it was that. I don't think it was like that bad. I don't think it was D tier. Um, I feel like it was decent. Like it wasn't anything special. I feel like saying D, saying it was D tier, saying it's below average, and I don't think the trailer was below average. Yeah. I don't know. Fuck you guys, Pat Luigi. Yeah. Love you guys. But oh, I love fuck you. Oh, fuck you too. Putting it in C tier. Um. Okay. Uh, Chrom and Dark Samus. I think this is also C tier, just cause I mean, yeah. There's not much to really go off of with this. And Chrom's your boy. My yeah. dog cutscene was there, so I would probably say say a D, um, a C tier as well. i yeah, I mean like it was a trailer, so like included it, but yeah, Cloud S tier. Yes. So I don't think I think we're all in an agreement that Cloud's trailer was an S tier. Yes, we're sir. Corin, I don't know. You see, like the trailer was fine. I like the little thing where it's like it chooses to be in Smash. But I have to, I, I have, I do have to like, you know, include the reveal. It was kind of like, really, you have corn. Uh, you have your third new Fire Emblem character of the game as your final character, second to last character, really. And it got right to the point, like you knew immediately that it was gonna be corn. And I don't know. I think this might be my least favorite, if I'm being honest. What do you guys think? Yeah, let's go with D. I'll be honest as well. I'll have to go with D tier as well. Slash. Oh um, man, I mean, I don't know. Obviously, um, it was annoying that there was a Final Fantasy. I mean, not what? Uh, a third Fire Emblem character, but that's not really the trailer's fault. I still think the trailer was decent. The trailer was decent, like, yeah. I, but like. Yeah, I think the trailer is just D tier. But overall, I would say, like, the prospect uh, slash reveal of Korn being in the game would be a D tier. Yeah. But I think the trailer itself was a C tier. But whatever. Uh, there, there's just something about this trailer, I feel, that just kind of rubbed me the wrong way. Duck Hunt. I like Duck Hunt's trailer, because uh, I like the little thing with the 8-bit characters, you know, and then they... Yeah, I like that, too. You know, I'll, and then, and then, I and then like... um, all pixelated characters, like, come into, like, actual Smash 4 cutscene. Yeah, they and, and really then well. this, this give it an the, A tier. Yeah, the, and then, like, the... CG footage of like the zapper and stuff. I thought that was really cool. That I, I I'd say A tier as wheel as wheel. What the fuck? As, as well, Pat Luigi slash. What do you guys think? Yeah, I'm gonna have to go with maybe A tier. Slash. Yeah, I mean, I think that's that's a fair assessment. It, it tried something different. It was unique. It wasn't bad, and the character itself was interesting. So. Yeah. Yeah, I would I would say A tier is sufficient. Alright, everyone is yeah. here, S tier, I don't even think we need to, that, that might be, that might be my favorite Smash trailer ever, if I'm gonna be honest. Like, no of, the, of every yeah. single one on here, I think that one might be my favorite. Like, I'm thinking, I've been wanting to do a top 10 uh, best trailers of all time, best game trailers of all time, that's gonna crack the list. That's, that, 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 that's gonna be the Smash representative. Greninja, I think Greninja's was also really good. Um, I, I like Greninja, yeah. I'm not sure if it's... I'm honestly not sure if it's S or A. It, like, might be, might also be a. S. Cause j just cause, uh, you like it, it had a little fake out. Like you thought it was Mewtwo, um, and then like most, if you weren't a Pokemon fan, you thought that was Mewtwo up until like the, up until they showed Greninja, you know, um, and it's like, I don't know, it was just, 
And then the, the way that they showed uh, Charizard kind of treating him like a new character, although he, you know, wasn't a new character, but he was by himself, yeah. which he wasn't before, so that was Exactly. Cool. So... Yes, sir. I'm, I'm, I'm going to say A tier. A tier for you? I'm not sure, so, uh, Slash. I, I don't know. Pat Luigi, what do you think? I felt like, like I said, I mean, it, it's a good show, but it's not as good as The Cloud, but yeah, I'm going to have to say it's going to be an A tier. All right, Slash. Just because. I don't know. A tier, right? Then. Okay. I feel like it's. Oh, A tier? Okay. No, oh, no, no, you got something to say. Sorry, go. Yeah, I was going to say. I, I mean, I like this reveal a lot, but I don't think. I feel like it's top of A tier. I feel like the other stuff that's in S is just kind of on another level. In yeah. terms that's of true. This is probably, like, better than the other two trailers in A tier. Uh, sorry if you can hear some background noises. There is a bit of a party going on in my house right I'm now. I'm not sorry. Um, all right, the next trailer I think might even beat cool. Ninja's Heroes trailer. Like, I don't know. Like, the reveal for Hero is a little eh, just because uh, we got an anime swordsman. I I was down for Hero once I saw him, but like uh, he was, he was. Uh, like, you know, the, the <laughs> fight between uh, Link and the evil Marth and evil Meta Knight, and then uh, and then later on when they showed the. Uh, the costumes. I thought what, the way they showed the costumes. I thought that was awesome. A tier, maybe even S tier, maybe even S tier. I, you know, what? I'm thinking S tier. What do you guys think? Yeah, I guess an S tier. I guess Incineroar. Um, despite the fact that I don't think Incineroar should have been the last character. Like honestly, you revealed Incineroar and Ken the day after Halloween, but in August you revealed Simon and Richter from Castlevania. Sort of a Halloween-themed uh, game. You could have swapped the two. That would have been perfect. I don't get why they didn't do that. But that aside, I thought this trailer was pretty cool. You know, you got Ken and Incinero. They're both fiery characters. So uh, it made sense to group them together. Um, I thought this was a this pretty solid trailer. I thought it was an A tier. Uh, what do you guys think? I would probably say an A tier as well. Yeah, I agree. Hey. Okay. Isabel. I don't... Isabel! Okay, Is... no, I'm just kidding. Isabel's trailer, like... You thought it was an Animal Crossing game, and later on, it was an Animal Crossing game. That's how it was presented in the direct, but, uh... I mean, the trailer wasn't really anything special, I feel. I feel like that... I feel like it's a C tier, if I'm being honest. Yeah, I mean, it was alright. And, I mean, I mean like, Isabel was also, like... We knew she was gonna be in the game. Like... Yeah. What do you guys think, though? For me, I know- I know I'm an- I know you guys know that I'm definitely an Animal Crossing fan. Like, I just yeah. thought, like, 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 the place and the town hall at the beginning of the cutscene while Isabel was working. Like, I- it looked just like the same, which I felt, like, um, kind of weird. Because, and then the moment- I, f I forgot, um... The male duck's name when the duck Pete. gave, yeah, Pete. When Pete gave Isabel the envelope, uh, I that thought was obviously like, right? It was obviously I'm in Smash now. Exactly. So I'll probably give it a C tier as well. Yeah, it's slash Pat, C tier. C. I don't know. I thought it was done interestingly, but interesting isn't always good. The, now we have Joker on here twice because he did get he did kind of get two different trailers. Uh, we got Joker uh, his reveal at the Game Awards, the one where there was no gameplay. Honestly, like honestly, that might be an S tier. I don't know. Like, if, yeah. if it was like if you combine the two trailers and revealed it the way it was revealed, an instant S tier. But I don't, could I still think this reveal was an S tier just because. Like, no one expected this, and it w no one had any, like, there was no sort of hint that it was, like, a Smash, Joker and Smash, until, like, the envelope. So that's what I think. What do you guys think? Yeah, I would probably have to give it an A tier as well, because on the first trailer of Joker, like, I, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure uh, almost all the people were really hyped for Joker to, to get in Smash. But even though they didn't really, they didn't really show the move sets on the first on the first cut on the first trailer. But then the second trailer, I thought I thought it worked um, good as well. So I'll probably give that one an S tier. Yeah, and then we got uh, the Joker like gameplay trailer. I think we can put that in A tier. I don't know, the, just because like the hype and the like, you know, 
who is this gonna be was gone because we knew it was Joker, but we got to see his moves. Yeah. So I think we can agree that, like, it was still a good trailer, and you put these together, it's like, maybe even, like, top of S tier. The most recent one, Kazuya. Oh, yeah. This one was a weird oh, trailer. Yeah. Like, I remember, like, watching it and kind of, like, being like, this is kind of weird. Because, I don't know, like, they... Kazuya was presented as, like, a Tekken character, because he is a Tekken character, but, like, it, 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 like all the gameplay shown seemed like gameplay from a Tekken game. That's how the, they presented the trailer. I don't know. It was weird, but like I kind of like that. But I can't put it too high. I feel like B tier. What do you guys think? I'll give it B tier. B tier. Yeah, B tier. All right. Uh, King K rule. This one was hype. This one was hype. I'm Probably sure an most. Probably an A tier. I feel. Yeah, I, I know most of guns really wanted an antagonist, um, being Smash. Yeah. So I'll give it an A tier as well. What do you guys think? Except for Man Sam, because he just answered. Sure. Little Mac, I love the art style in this, and I love the little stuff with uh, him and Samus, with the whole, like, you know, you're short thing, fuck you, no I'm not, I mean I am, but like, oh, what a, I think A tier, maybe even S tier, maybe S tier is a little too much, but uh, I agree, I'll probably right give an a, a tier as well. Alright, uh, yeah. Lucas, yeah. the Lucas trailer was weird, I remember. Not a bad, yeah. I, I don't think any of these trailers are particularly bad, by the way. But like, Corrin. I thought Lucas, no, Corrin's wasn't even bad, it was just, It was eh. the worst. Yeah. Um, also, I feel like putting Corrin at the bottom of everything, just saying. Uh, but, uh, Lucas's was weird, it was just, like, the way it was presented was very strange. If you know what I mean? Cause like, I don't know, I, I can't really explain it, which I know I should never say that, like, oh, for some weird reason, I don't like this very much, but that's what I'm doing here, so, C tier? That's what I'm thinking. I would probably give it a C tier, yeah. I feel like sure. that's harsh, though, because, I mean, it's Lucas, how could you not love Lucas? I fucking hate that kid, he I, 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 I saw that coming, that was almost like a segue into that. Mega Man, I think, is S tier. It's weird the way, like... Uh, we have this Mewtwo, which, uh, which isn't even really a trailer, but, like, this reveal is also super hype. Like, if it was just the reveals of each character, these are specifically the trailers, but if it was just the reveals, this would go in S tier. But, um, it, was, it wasn't it was much of a trailer, it was just, here's Mewtwo, he's coming soon. Um, That's true. Yeah, I'll have to agree. And I know we separated the two Joker ones, but I feel like these two we have to kind of lump together. And if that's the case, I think it's S tier just because. Bees, I also think was S tier just because. Yeah, you. I agree. Awada versus Reggie, come on. And it was all. It also served as a way to re uh, reveal amiibos as well, which was cool. That trailer yeah, was fire. Yeah, great editing. His body there. was ready. Yeah. It was that time. Um. Yeah, Min Min, another S tier. The art style and everything, and then Captain Falcon eating ramen, was which kind of became a little bit of a meme. That became a big game. Uh, I thought this was, uh, definitely one of the best Smash trail Smash Ultimate trailers. What do you guys think? Yeah. Definitely an S tier. Yeah. Pac-Man, this one was weird. I liked, you know, the whole, like, you know, showing Mario, Sonic, and Mega Man. Uh, but then, the way they revealed this, the, the way they showed this trailer, it wasn't, like, in any, you know, it, it wasn't in any, you know, Nintendo Direct or anything. It was E3. But he was revealed at some, like, behind closed doors conference or some shit. So, like, only, like, industry insiders got to see the trailer, like, live or whatever. And then they dropped it as a YouTube video. And, yeah, it was, it was weird. That was weird. But, uh, but yeah, Pac-Man was still hype. But what, I don't, I actually don't know where to put Pac-Man, to be honest. What do you guys think? I would probably put... For me, I would probably go either an A or a B tier. I'm gonna go with B. B? Yeah. Yeah, I think B as well. Slash? Yeah, B is fine, I guess. Alright, B it is. Palutena, I like the art style they went with for Palutena's trailer. And I I like the way it was presented and everything. I don't think it's an S tier, but A tier is what I think. What do you guys think? I also like the part when Link and Pit were fighting each other. That was with, awesome. With, that was awesome. With the, an, with the anime version, I thought it looked so cool. Eight that was, tier. Yeah. That was awesome. That was pretty good. Yeah. Sorry, Boys. Slash. We, we don't need your opinion. We, we, we've decided. Good to know. 
Piranha Plant. I, <laughs> Piranha Plant was super hype, but like this trailer, like, I don't know if it was any if it's anything we can rank too high. Like all, all it is for for the Piranha Plant cutscene was just the gameplay footage, like like not an actual cutscene. Hold I find on, it kind of weird, on, but on. but it was kind of fight. Out of the I, plant. No. You popped out of the plant too. Don't we can't forget. Yeah, we can't yeah. forget that. I'll probably get it. I think B tier is like the highest. I say B tier to them. Sure. Pirate Mithra. This one was a weird one. This was like it didn't feel like a Smash trailer really. It was probably the longest Smash trailer just because they like. Uh, this is the one time where like the CG team that makes most of the Smash Ultimate trailers didn't make this one. It was like Monolith Soft that made like a full on cutscene for the trailer and then showed Pyra and Mithra in Smash. So that was interesting. The trailer went on. The trailer was really long though, but it was a good trailer. I'm gonna say B tier. What do you guys think? Yeah, I'm gonna say B tier as well. Slash. Yeah, B tier, sure. Okay. Ridley. Ridley was a that was a good trailer and we got fucking Mario just loves dying. I no, this, 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 was, this was the start of like Ma of characters dying in these uh, Smash trailers. Most um, importantly, Mario. Mario died twice. My boy. <laughs> yeah. I'll get, I say an A tier. A or S? It might actually be S. S. I feel like it was just. Like, the fact that Ridley was never supposed to be in Smash, and then he, they fucking put him in anyways, was kind of baller, I don't know. I mean, we really needed uh, another antagonist anyway, so I guess an S, S here. yeah, I think S is good. S. Robin, this was a good trailer. Um, it revealed Robin, but not only Robin, it revealed Lucina, and it, uh... It revealed the return of Captain Falcon. That's th this is a trailer for three characters, which I thought was yeah. awesome. And the fight between uh, uh, Lucina and Captain Falcon, I thought was really cool. And that then, was epic. You know the art style, the way that they showed like the same like you know aesthetic as the Fire Emblem Awakening cutscenes, I thought was really cool. I don't know if I could put a nest here. I think that might be a little too high, but A tier. And Chrome was there. Yeah, uh, too bad. Like at the very end of the cutscene. Too bad. I mean, Chrome did get in, but it was too bad that he couldn't get in Smash. So I'll probably go with an A tier. Yeah. Sorry, Pat. We're moving on. Wait. What? Well, uh, Rosalina and Luma. I like this trailer. Um, it was I, love the, I love the Mario Kart animation. If yeah, you, with if, the Mario Kart. I don't know if you noticed this, but like, I don't think any of the footage of like any of the gameplay of Rosalina. I don't think she was fighting in any of that, which I thought was. She weird. wasn't. Yeah, true. But like the CG with the Mario Kart characters and Kirby, just characters, just the crossover. I really love that. I don't know about S tier though. I think A tier. What do you guys think? I think an A tier as well. Yeah. A tier. Roy. What? I, th I thought Roy's trailer was good. It kind it there wasn't too much to it really. It kind it just got Wasn't right it? to the point. Yeah. It was like okay, so Martha's here, Ike is here, Robin's here, Lucina's here, but what about Roy? I'm Roy. Roy is here now, and fuck you, Roy Koopa. That was that was the trailer for you, and then a bunch of gameplay. And I thought it was cool. It was good for what it was. It, it was a returning character. There wasn't a whole lot you could do for a trailer for a returning character. I don't think I can't put an S tier. Can't put it in the A tier, I don't even think. Roy's my boy, though, so it was, it was a good trailer. It was definitely a good trailer. Let's go, T. Do you guys agree? Yes, sir. I agree, yeah. No. Why no? not? No, I'm just fucking with you. Okay. Ryu. I thought Ryu's trailer was really good. Sure, he got leaked, but that has nothing to do with the trailer, really. The trailer, like, was done with... It's to, like, replicate the, uh... You know the intro cutscene to it was like I think it was Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo, and I thought that was awesome. Uh, I think S tier actually. I don't know. What do you guys think? Hmm. I mean, I'm just gonna say like like it is very good, but it, it's probably not the best for me. I would probably say an A, a tier. S Pat Luigi slash. Hmm. That's slash, you go first. Saying. No, you go first. <laughs> Dude. Uh, what have you guys I fucking made up my mind. No. I don't know. <laughs> Neither do I. Um, Alright, let's just say it on three, okay, Pat? Ready? Okay. One, two, what? One, two, three. A. A. Yeah. 
Hey! Okay, I'm wrong now. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. Uh, who, who is this? Sephiroth? Sorry, I think Sephiroth is probably like my favorite newcomer trailer from Ultimate. I so think might have to go on S. Yeah. Sephiroth is, yeah. The, like, the yeah, way he was, he was, pre I love the, how the trailer presented him like a villain, you know? Like, not just the CG, but, like, the gameplay as well presented him like a villain, if you know what I mean. He almost killed someone. Yeah. Moving on, <laughs> uh, Shulk. I thought this trailer was cool. It kind of got right to the point, though. Uh, you know, Bowser coming out, Roar. Link. Uh, oh, yeah, Link, Link, I forgot Bowser. Link and Marth were there. Um... So yeah, I thought this trailer was awesome, uh, but not, I don't know. I say an A tier. Yeah, that's what I think. Slash, yes. Pat? I would agree, yeah. A tier. Alright. Uh, I, I can't even tell who it, Simon and Richter, I thought I, their trailer was pretty, was really good, I liked that one. I thought it was legendary too, but I don't, I don't know if it's- Luigi I don't know fucking if it's... died in that. Like, and then the trailer, you know, the way they revealed Simon, and then the way they revealed Richter, who was really unexpected, I feel. Uh, was awesome. A or S? One of the two, I honestly think. It's, it's, I, I, I would probably say S. Contender for S tier. Slash Pat, what do you guys think? Uh, maybe S. I don't know. I'm sure we'll go S. Alright, okay, now uh, the uh, initial reveal trailer, that's an S tier. I we don't, S -tier. We don't need to dwell on that one. Snake? Uh, I think that one's an S tier, actually. From from Brawl, yeah. S. Um, <laughs> Sonic, S. All right. Um, who's this one? Steve, S. I think Steve. I love Minecraft. S. S. Yes, I agree. That was very surprising. You, know, you, want, you guys want to know something funny? Is what? it what? Steve, so Steve, Sonic, and Steve all? Wait, wait. What? Snake, Sonic, and Steve all start with S. Snake, Sonic, and Steve. Shut oh, the fuck up. Snake, they Sonic, and Steve all start with S, and they're in S tier. That's what, that's uh, what I said. Uh, Shut up. Funny. That's what I said. Uh, I literally that. said that. No, 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 I was reiterating what you said. But uh. Yeah, sure you were. All right, next up is Terry, and he got two trailers. One was. I mean, one was basically the other with gameplay, and here's what I think. I thought this one, the one where they revealed Terry but then showed, like, now in development, I thought was weird that they just did that, um, especially since they were able to show him and drop him two months later. Like, you couldn't show a little bit of gameplay, which they did later on in, like, the Sakurai Presents for Banjo, but you couldn't show that much, like... I don't know, that was weird. Um, but then, uh, I, lo I love the little thing with all the little SNK characters trying to get, uh, trying to get the inv invitation. I thought this little thing about, uh, this little thing with Terry, um, the reveal I thought was in A tier just because of, you know, all the... Yeah, characters. I'll probably say it's A tier as well. What do you guys, uh, Slash Pat, what do you guys think? Sure, A tier. About? I'm just kidding, yeah, A tier. Alright, um, and then, uh... The, here's the other Terry trailer, the one with gameplay. I thought that was weird, you know, and especially since you like they were they they showed this trailer at the end of the presentation, w which was just going over all of Terry's moves. So we knew his moves. There was no why did the, why was this at the end of the pre B I think C tier act. Uh, no, the trailer was still cool. B I say either B or C. I think B. C is a little too harsh. B. Alright, then B. Villager and subsequently the uh, yeah, Smash 4 B. reveal. I think that's S tier. Yes, yes sir. sir! The Smash yes, 4 the, the Smash 4 reveal alone, I think, is S tier. But then you throw in like this that the fact that this is also like the villager trailer. Um so you throw in a newcomer trailer and lump that in with the Smash 4 trailer. I thought that's really cool. Did this also start the whole letter thing? Yeah, I think I think it might have, yeah. Um, and yeah. then last but not least, we Fit Trainer, which I thought was weird. This is the only Smash trailer to show, like, all the gameplay and then show the splash art screen. That like, was all I really all I liked, weird. All I liked is that they were actually doing, um... We Fit, uh, when, we, when we Fit was on, I thought, I thought, like, the characters, Mario, Link, and Kirby, 
I thought it looked pretty cool. Dude, but no, I, I, I like, I like that. I liked how they were all doing We Fit, but like I just yeah, thought that was the, this was a weird. I think it might be the shortest one as well. Ah, this, I would say B tier or A. I don't, I don't know. I think C, honestly, just because oh, this was a very weird trailer. I don't know. Slash Pat, what do you guys think? You guys are the deciding factor. B tier. I mean, it is oh. kind of weird that um, a, like a Wii Fit trainer did get into Smash. Some kind of yeah, coach was trying to train us. I don't know. I'll go. Huh? Speak. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it was that bad. I think this is a B tier. Actually, you know, let's go see. Let's go see. All right. I think it's three, three to one. We're done. I think Ryu and Greninja both probably should be low S, but that's pretty much the only thing I would change. I think it's a good tier list. So yeah, this is uh, our Smash trailer tier list. Um, we should have waited till the last character was announced, actually, just so we can yeah. have all of them. But, uh, They're black. Yeah, we can't resist. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. So, uh, that, that's, this is our uh, tier list of Smash trailers. Uh, what do you guys think? Comment below, uh, and uh, we'll, I'll, well, one of us will respond to you, uh, telling you that you're wrong. Anyways, uh... <laughs> yeah, fuck you. <laughs> thanks for watching Sean the video, though, though, guys. Uh, Alright, see you guys. Bye!